Meanwhile, involving Officer Hamilton, he will be laid to rest this weekend. Again, he died in the line of duty Tuesday night. And last night, hundreds of people began to say their final goodbyes. LEX 18's Lindsay Piercy joins us now in the studio with details. Lindsay, good morning. Good morning. The mood in Pikeville this weekend is somber, as yesterday marked the first of two visitations for Officer Hamilton. People from around the state gathered at Pikeville's East Kentucky Expo Center for several hours. Family, friends, and even strangers stopped by to honor Hamilton. Some say the visitation will help the community continue to heal. Many also shared emotional stories of how Hamilton touched their lives. I want his family to know how much he's respected. I want the rest of his brothers to know how much he was respected. A second visitation will also be held today from noon until 9 p.m. Hamilton's funeral is scheduled for 1 o'clock tomorrow. Services will once again be held at the East Kentucky Expo Center. Hamilton is survived by his wife, Chelsea, and his infant daughter. Back to you. Lindsay, thank you so much. Meanwhile, Governor Matt Bevin is ordering flags at state government buildings be flown at half staff tomorrow in honor of Officer Hamilton. In a statement, Governor Bevin asked for prayers for Pikeville, the state and local police involved, and Officer Hamilton's family. He also encourages everyone who flies a flag to lower theirs to half staff tomorrow. It's